everyone, it's Joy Lene and I'm back for Vlogmas Day 7. Happy Monday! I hope that your day is going well and I hope that you have some time to carve out into your schedule to watch this video because you're not going to miss it. I'll be doing a holiday glam face today. So whether you're going to a holiday party via Zoom, in person, or if you just want to look cute for the holiday season, then this tutorial is for you look no further I'll be focusing mainly on the eyes as well as the lips so as it pertains to foundation and bronzer blush highlight choose whatever items you would like but for the eyes and for the lips you might want to stay tuned and take notes I'm just saying so either grab some makeup items and do this look along with me or stay tuned and watch as always before I get into my video don't forget to subscribe as well as tap the button and get notifications so that anytime that I drop a vlogmas or any other video, you will be notified. And follow me on Instagram at pure.joylifestyle. Again, I have a giveaway coming up real soon and you're gonna need to follow me in order to be eligible. So go ahead and do it anyway. All right guys, let's get into the look. I won't be showing you guys a full detailed look for my face, like I said, I'll be focusing on the eyes and the lips, but I will show you a few steps here and there. First things first, your girl has to start off with her primer. I already did my skincare routine, moisturize, all of that. I'm gonna go in with this Wet n Wild Photo Focus Base Matte. Okay, and I really like this. Let me see if it'll focus for you guys. Put it over here, there you go. And I like it just because it gives me a nice matte base and blurs everything out. I've been using a hydrating, um, primer it hasn't necessarily been working out the best for me because it makes me feel really oily and greasy so I've been switching to this one it's nice and matte and putty feeling and I love it and it just glides on put it wherever you feel like you need to I'm gonna put some extra on my cheeks because it's where I get my oils and then next I'm going to go in with a foundation and today I'm decided I'm just gonna go with my old faithful my Maybelline Superstay foundation so I'm gonna put that on and then I'm gonna come back with it in a little bit so you guys can see me do my concealer. Alrighty, so your girl has laid her foundation. Okay, sitting nice, it's sitting pretty. And if you guys see here, this is just my headband that I use to protect it from, you know, getting everywhere. I have really low baby hair, so some of it I can't protect. But for the most part, it works out nicely. So now I'm gonna go in with my quick conceal from the lip bar. I have it in the color cinnamon in the four o'clock family. Okay. This is actually new to the lip bars line, but I love it. It's really hydrating and I love the coverage on it. So no complaints from me. And again, I'm gonna go here. You know, you, your girl got some bags, okay? It happens when, you know, you be doing boss things and you don't get no sleep. And then I will conceal right here. I have a scar, so I conceal right there, but that's not normally a place where you would conceal. But I'll do my under eyes there. I'll do over here if I'm going to contour. And I'm just going to let this sit and dry down for probably about 10 minutes. If you let your concealer dry down, it'll give you more coverage. So I'm going to go ahead and I might do my eyebrows while I wait. So yeah. Okay. Now I'm just baking underneath my eyes. So while I'm baking, I'm going to go ahead and do my eyeshadow look. I'm going to start off with some colors from my minted every day is it every day the everyday eyeshadow palette and i'm going to go in here with this color as my transitional color and i'm going to where's my brush when you need? okay take this nice brush right here and then dip into it two times tap it off and then just go right into my crease area back and forth motions Ooh, that's a pretty color. And then again, I'm going to dip into it and do the same thing to my other eye. Just in my crease and swooping back and forth motions. And I always try to make sure that both of my eyes are even. I don't want to have more purple or brown than the other. Okay. And then I'm going to go in with this middle color. I wish I had my color chart, hold on. That color, so the color I use in my transition is called Brown Out. And then the color that I'm gonna use on my lid is called Queen Sugar, which will be this color here. 
And I'm just going to go in with a regular small shade brush. Tap in two times. Tap off my excess. I'm going to go right in on my lid. All over my lid. Again, if you need more, go ahead and grab some more. Just going to make sure I put it all over my lid. And what I want to do is I want to have just a really, really nice base because I'm going to go over it with some glitter because, you know, nothing says holiday like a glitter eye. So I just want to make sure that I have a nice color there in my lid. Do the same thing to this eye with that queen sugar color. And it's like a maroon, raspberry, brown kind of color that I'm going in with here, this queen sugar. And it even has like a tint of like a shimmer in there, which is okay. And then I'm going to take this, wipe it off in paper towel, and I'm simply just going to blend the lid with the crease so that there's no lines of demarcation and that it looks just nice and smooth. Just blend that all around. Okay. And then next, I'm going to go in with my liquid eyeshadow. This is a new eyeshadow that I just got in from the lip bar. And <clears throat> I'm gonna plug myself. I am a lip bar affiliate, and I'm a lip bar affiliate because I believe in the company and because I genuinely, truly like the products. Um, I could actually more than likely probably do a full face of lip bar makeup. But if you guys are interested in any of the following lip bar products that I use, feel free to use the link that I provide below and I will also specifically link any of the lip bar products that I use today. And if you guys use the code PureJoy10 or if you use my link, you guys can get 10% off. Trust me, you're gonna wanna use these products if you haven't already. So I'm going to go in with this nice pretty gold color here and this is the color Girl Next Door. And if you see that, that is a nice pretty, pretty gold. And because I just lay this here, I'm going to go, I'm trying, I'm debating if I want to use an eyeshadow primer to really make it pop. I may use just a little bit. And I'm going to put just a little bit, just on my first eyelid area. So that when I put this glitter on, it just, you know, it pops. Because, you know, you're trying to pop for the holiday party, okay? The face needs to be beat. You need to let them know. Holiday party, I came to slay all day. And then just dab it on with your finger in the eyelid region. Cause that is where we're going to put the glitter. Makeup always looks crazy before you get to the final look. I know sometimes my boyfriend be like, girl, what you got on? And again, this is a liquid eyeshadow. So you simply get to brush it over your eye. I'm gonna brush it on my lid. Do, do you see that? Look at that pigment. Yes, and then I'm gonna go ahead and take a clean finger. I'm just gonna dab it out like so. And just gently, I'm gently tapping it on my lid just to kind of see what it looks like, okay? It's nice. And I'm gonna go ahead and put a little bit more on over here. Oh, that's pretty. I like this glitter, that is very pretty. And then I'm gonna go ahead and do the same thing for my other eye. Oh my gosh, look at that, look at that. I don't even wanna tap this in with my finger, I just wanna leave it where it is. That's really pretty. It's really pretty, and I'm gonna go in with my brush, my flat brush, and just kinda of pat that in. That is super duper pretty. Ooh. And we go back here and pat this in and clean this one up so that this eye can be nice and neat and even like the other one. Yes. Oh, this is pretty. Okay, so I am going to go in with an eyeliner. I'm going to use my Rare Beauty eyeliner and just give myself a nice quick really thin line. And I'm not even going to go all the way on my eyeliner. I'm just going to go just right in the corner. 
right in the corner just to kind of give it like that nice evening look and I'm gonna wing it out a little bit you can see there just wing it out a little bit okay and I'm really not worried about going in with an eyeliner too much on the top just because I want the glitter to pop and when I put on the lashes you're really not gonna see it too much anyway and I'm gonna go ahead and do it to the other side see how far over I put that Kind of, you know, it's hard for me to talk and do my makeup with my eyes. So, I, okay. And I'm going to fix this one. This one curves a little bit. But now I'm going to go ahead and put on my lashes so we can complete this eye look. Okay, so if you guys see it here, I have finished my eye look with the liquid eyeshadow. I'm loving this gold color that we have going on here on the eyelids. Okay, it's very festive. So now I'm going to go in with my... Lip Bar Bronzer and Blush Duo. The bronzer is the color that is on top here. Oh, my cover just flew, fell out. And I'm going to go in with my Fast Face Dual Sided uh, Brush. This side is for the bronzer, and this one will be for the blush. And then this is the blush color underneath here. So you guys see, it has a nice little pretty shimmer to it. And the bronzer even has a shimmer to it, but it's just the perfect bronzer. It, the, the subtleties are nice, and again, a little bit goes a long way. I do two scoops and I'm tapping off my excess and I'm gonna put it right along my cheekbones right there where I wanna bronze, okay? Put a little bit more over here just to even that out. And then I'm gonna take it, I'm also gonna go around, you know, my forehead and kind of just bring some warmth back into my face. So all around the edges, the outlines of my face. You can even do your jaw area if you wanted to. I don't necessarily like to blend with this brush too much when there's a lot of product on here, but I just wipe it all off from going around. So I'm just gonna circular motions, bronze that in there. Bronze that puppy in there. Ooh. You see how it's making my cheeks just. Okay, that's that's the effect that you want. Okay. And then I'm gonna flip it up. And I'm going to take the other side and go in for my blush. And again, I just did two dabs because a little bit goes a long way. See the blush? You see the pink already? Look at look at that subtlety. That subtle pink. And I'm going to go in with a different brush just to kind of blend it out. Just because I since I already have so much product on there, I didn't want it to be a whole bunch of product on the blush. And again, circular motions on the apples of my cheeks. Okay, has a nice little shimmer going on there. And we'll that we're done with that section. So the last thing that we need to do is the lips. And I'm going to use my Boss Lady Red Lip from the Lip Bar. And if you watch my last video where I go over my holiday red lips, you'll see it in there. And if you know, it's just a bomb red lip. It's not too dark, it's not too bright, it's a nice liquid matte, so it lasts for a long, long time. And I'm gonna go in with that color. I gotta be quiet while I do this. I'm gonna try to at least line the outsides first. Cause I'm not gonna use a lip liner with this one. This one goes on pretty nicely that I don't need a lip liner. Look at that red. Yes, this is nice and glossy and juicy. Uh, look at that. You know, invite me to all the Christmas parties with this color. Okay, all the Christmas parties. Mm -mm -mm. Clean it up where I need to. Okay. I need to go change my clothes because I need to, you know, get in the holiday spirit for real. Hold. Your girl is back with a final look. And just to recap, I have Boss Lady on my lips and the Lip Bar's Liquid Matte. I have Direct Deposit, the Bronzer and Blush Duo on my cheeks. I have the Girl Next Door Liquid Eyeshadow in gold 
on my eyelids and I also have on the caffeine concealer and this is a final look. I'm super duper pleased with how it came out. I feel very, very festive, like I'm ready to hit the Zoom, I'm ready to go to the party in person or to even just wear it to the Christmas table on Christmas day. I hope that you guys like this look. Give me a thumbs up if you like it. Also, let me know what items you wanna steal from this look. I'll be sure to link all of my lip bar items below or you guys can head over to the lip bar and use Pure Joy 10 at checkout to save some coins on whatever items you purchase. They're actually having some really good um, holiday sales going on, so make sure you guys check in on the lipbar.com with them. And as always, don't forget to tap the bell and get notifications and subscribe if you haven't already done so. And then follow me on Instagram at pure.joylifestyle. I hope you guys enjoy the look and thanks for watching. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Day eight.